The item won't be destroyed upon failure. This is a no boom. This is a no boom right here. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sorful here, and today I wanted to do something similar to things I've done in the past, like for the Meso sacks. I bought a bunch of them and pretty much answered the question of whether or not it was worth it uh, buying those Meso sacks. And from that video, particularly, Meso sacks are definitely not worth the money. So I wanted to try and do this again and kind of just give a small sample size of some of the things you might be getting from philosopher books. Now, I've never ever purchased these in the past, although they were around in MapleStory for quite some time now, but I just never looked into them and it was never something that I was really interested in. However, now, they introduced the permanent second pendant slot to the Philosopher books, so I'm going to try and get lucky. Um, we're going to go ahead into the cash shop right now and pick up a pack. I believe it's 26k for either 10 books or 11 books. Uh, so it's going to be in limited time and so it's 11 books for 26k so they are pretty expensive um, but yeah let's hope uh, that they're not stingy with giving those permanent second pendant slots uh, we already have our keys and these are 11 books so let's see exactly how these work because again this is my first time purchasing these um, so yeah so I have my keys in my ETC inventory right here philosophical pen I didn't know that's how you spell philosophical or is it philosoph philosa philosophical philosophical pen yeah I'm an idiot it's philosophical pen <laughs> all right so I just assume it was philosophical philosophical oh my god I'm just killing myself now so screw that I'm really tired right now so you guys could probably tell in my voice but um so yeah let's uh, see so so we just click OK, I guess. So we have 11. Let's see what the first one gives. Yes. Whoa, we got an A neb from the first one. 3% HP, not the best. If that was decent sharp eyes or something, that would have paid off for like the entire uh, run almost. So that would have been amazing. But we got two pretty good things. I mean, this is something I could actually probably sell or just give to one of my meals. Um, okay, and they already have the window here, so this is a little bit exciting, you know, it's my very first time ever opening these, so the first roll, I would say, is pretty good, um, it's not bad, another ANEB, wow, and Angelic Shooter, uh, this is a little bit better now, too bad it's a, you know, Angelic Buster weapon, um, but yeah, Fafner weapon now, since they are a little bit harder to get, um, is pretty, pretty interesting, and then we got a Luck Neb, ANEB, alright, number three, Another A neb and a 50% hammer. If this was 100%, I know I keep saying if, 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 um, but so far I'm actually kind of surprised with the rewards. I mean, I'm getting shitty nebs, but I did not think I'd be getting, you know, A nebs at this rate. Again, these are 2.6k a piece, so, you know, it makes sense to be giving A nebs, uh, but so far they've been crappy. But let's see what we could keep getting. Uh, this is the fourth one, so another HP neb. Okay, this is just useless, so we're not even going to talk about that. Um, let's see what the fifth one has to offer. Okay, I didn't even know these were still a thing, but hey, sure, why not? Um, that That is not worth 2.6k at all in that, in that one book. Um, prime scroll for armor. Okay, so we got a prime scroll. So they do give prime scrolls, that's pretty cool. Um, 2.6k... Yeah, this, this paid off for a couple of books right here, most likely. At least two books. Um, so that's pretty good. Blue Dragon Chair. The item won't be destroyed upon failure. This is a no boom. This is a no boom right here. This is a lot of money, so this paid for a lot of books. Maybe the whole run. I don't know how much they cost right now because I don't see them. But the item won't be destroyed upon failure. I mean, I'm sleepy, so I gotta keep reading that to make sure it is a no-boom. Um, so that's really good. Really, really good. And we still got four books left, so I think we kind of paid off for the run already. Um, so that's pretty good. I could use this. I think my ETC is not maxed out yet. Mesa Ranger Android. If only it was a battle roid, huh? 
So we got three books left. It is still pretty exciting. Strength Nebulite and Useless Bow. I really want the Perma Pendant, second pendant slot, but I'm pretty sure we're not going to get it. So they do give out A-Nebs quite frequently. Um, obviously it's the crappy ones, uh, but you could just sell them off for about 200 mil a piece or, you know, fuse them and try and get something good, which I actually might do. And we got a two-star enhancement scroll that is tradable and a classic hair coupon, which is tradable as well, I believe. So let's go ahead and see. So this is our Noboom, our two-star tradable hair coupon. And it worked, nice. Got some extra space down here now. I think all my slots are about maxed out now, except for setup, so still working on that. Mesa Ranger coupon. So the Prime Scroll and the No Boom paid for a lot of it. Can maybe get a little bit out of this here coupon. Um, but yeah, depending on how much No Booms cost, I think we I think we paid for the run here. Um, so that's pretty cool. The weapons though didn't get quite lucky, but um, a lot of nebs as well, which are about two mil, two hundred mil pops. So that's four, six, eight, ten, twelve, one point two bill. Um, in nebs most likely maybe a little bit less maybe even a little bit more um, So yeah, we definitely paid for the run in mesos um, Which is quite cool to be honest. I kind of wanted to I kind of want to do more, but I don't really have the money to um, So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys found this video interesting In my opinion if I had to give a final verdict um, as to whether or not philosopher books are worth buying um, I'd have to say it really depends on what your goal is. If you're trying to make a profit from it, I'd, I feel like it is worth buying. Um, if you're trying to make a profit in terms of Meso, uh, I think it is worth buying because just from the 11 I opened, I was able to, I believe, uh, make a little bit of profit off the end. Um, and yeah, but if you're looking for you know things that you're going to use, Philosopher's Book is probably not for you. Because um, yeah. It's, I don't think it's worth paying, you know, 26k and X for 11 books just to get one no boom, right? You're probably better off um, just buying them. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hey, you made it to the end, and for that, you're awesome. While you're here, feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed what you just watched, and click one of these videos to be taken to one of my favorite, most recent uploads. Peace.